All right, we're here for match with our Naya Morph deck here on Just for Fun. I'm Matt. What up, players and playettes? We going to win the die roll and yeah, perfectly reasonable. I mean, not great, but we'll keep it. We'll play this. Vortex on turn one. Mountain Vortex, right? And then uh, the rest of what we're going to play is probably going to really confuse our opponents. <laughs> this is not a great hand by any means. Um, this Foothills um, wants to find a forest. Hopefully we draw another forest. Um, or a third land of some kind. But forest would be the best. And we'll go from there. All right. Opponent has plenty to say about that. Trail. Nice. Okay, so here we get to go. Forest. Trail. And we have a combo in play already. Hopefully our opponent doesn't just go land back to nature here. <laughs> That would not be fun. Now, any land gets us access to all the spells in our hand. Phalanx Leader, okay. More of my... If, if you know me, you know I'm just so sick of Heroic. I can't wait till Heroic rotates out. Um, we gambled here and we, we failed, so... We're going to have to bite the bullet and just pass back doing nothing, which is probably enough to, to lose us the game, honestly, against a deck like that. So, um, shame, shame. Mana Gorger, yeah, we're really dead. Okay, and what do we get here? Forest, okay. And here, I'm going to go Wild Call. For zero, which allows us to fetch a land, and I'll fetch a forest, I guess, doesn't matter, because I'm actually going to just pitch it to kill the Hydra. Alright. And what did we manifest here? An Iron Shaman, nice. Which kind of gives us an extra shot at hitting a land drop, perhaps. Another Hydra. You've got to be kidding me. Um, I guess we're going to do the same play here. But, you know, we can get blown out pretty bad with him having anything at all. So, I'm going to fetch here. I'm going to attack and maybe he'll block. I doubt it, but... No blocks. Um, so yeah, rather than flip up here, I think I'm gonna play this mastery. It's probably a mistake. Probably should should have just tried to kill it, but then I mean, then I'm really blown out there. I feel like God's willing is the phalanx leader and the dude, the thing just gets out of control big. Oh my god. That's disgusting. <laughs> oh my god. 
That's pretty horrifying. I've never seen that before. <laughs> All right. Uh, I guess this can just chomp here. Um, this can get flipped up. I mean, we're... Oh, right. I mean, I guess I could have... I could kill it with Dragon Slayer. Duh. Alright, so that was probably all a mistake there. A little, a little hasty. Okay, well... can get our fifth land here. I mean, but there's there's still a very good chance we just die. Might be a case of too little, too late. Definitely blocking that. And that's ten, which is not enough to kill me. Alright. So that I can basically cast for free. Cast that face down. Get another planes. Play the planes. Okay. So when we take out this Hydra this is going to lose all of its power and toughness and maybe we can eat it and gain life. That's my plan. But a lot, a lot has to go right for that to work so we'll see how we end up here. So we'll kill that. We gain two life from the mastery. Prevent all damage that would be dealt this turn. Oh, by your opponent's creatures. Okay, that's a little weird. Um to prevent me from gaining life, I guess. Um, okay. And do I need to block there? I think I'm... Well, I can't go to one because his bolster will kill me. So I think I'm forced to block there, unfortunately. Now my morphs cost one. So 
so I can cast that face down. Get a land. We'll get a uh, mountain. We'll play, play the mountain. We'll cast this face down. Okay, we'll get a forest. We'll cast that face down. We'll get a plains. We'll kill this thing. Um, we will with this, offer a trade there. Block, okay, pass back. Bolster one, on what? He gets to choose after it resolves. Um, so we do this and we kill that. That's doesn't really do much, so that's fine. All right. Um, so maybe I would have been better off just flipping up Iron Shaman, but... Okay, so he can't kill me right here. So I think I just win at this point. So let's flip up the Iron Shaman and gain four life. See, now this is what I was talking about, about how if you can outlast a deck you can really get an incredible amount of advantage. Forest, all right, sure, why not? Cast this face down. Yep, we'll grab. And see, we were almost out of lands in our deck because of this Trail of Mystery. We've drawn eight freaking cards off of. Um, we could attack with everything and flip this up. Uh, yeah, I think I want to do that. I think that might just win the game. No blocks. And let's do, do, do it. So gain five life. Back to 12, flip that up. Pump the team. get in there for way more than enough and win the game from way behind even though we played sloppy we honestly didn't deserve to win that game um i think we want these roasts i think that's that's for certain um and 
do we want arc lightning? I think we might want arc, arc lightning as well. Um, what did not seem good? Um, now that he knows about Master of Pearls, we can take those two out. And then we gotta cut four things. Um, he did have enchantments. Dragon Slayer seems good. Um, can maybe cut these phoenixes. I don't think we're gonna need them really to win. I think our little dudes are enough to just win, so. We did not deserve to win, but we did play we did play to our outs and we pulled it off there. Um that's a pretty ridiculous hand, but our opponent is has mold to six, so I think we'll just play it out. By the way, this deck is is post uh, rotation standard. Um, forgot to mention that in the deck tech. So this this deck will be fully legal um, in two weeks when everything rotates out um, and half of the cards that opponent is playing here are, will not be legal. Um, Alright, let's play trail. We can use that to grab a mountain and then our molten vortex will be online and we'll have molten trail molten mystery trail of vortex okay P opponents assembled his tron there um oh, double trail double rainbow let's cast that face down we might have to stall for a while here like we did last game. You see, opponent's deck is clever and, and interesting, but just playing um, God's Willing and Feet of Resistance is probably just better because it keeps your dudes um, free of removal and removal just ruins your deck. So, Like if I was playing that Black Red Control deck I was playing a few weeks ago, his deck would have zero chance um, but now he's kinda going off here yeah that's pretty pretty insane I think we're gonna be too slow to stop this here yeah because that thing has trample so even if we flip this up kill that. We still can't even kill the phalanx leader. And we have no way to profitably block the hydra. So I think we're just dead here. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Not really anything we could do about that. So. Wow. Wow. Opponent had to nut draw a six. Um, ooh, you know what? Instigator is probably great against him. Why didn't I notice that um, sooner? Um, so I'll trim a wild call. So none of our roasts or anything, but vortex into trail into morph. Which might be too slow, but we'll see. I think if he doesn't go off like he did last game, we have a really good chance. Um, ether is nice. We get to play that for free next turn. <laughs> mm. 
And if we can kill his dudes before they get out of control. Myth realized is pretty terrible. Especially I I mean he's seen that I have main deck enchantment hate. It just seems like a bad card to play, but Okay, um, so let's cast that face down. Fetch. Um, doesn't really matter here. So grab, grab, grab a mountain. Pass back. Attacks, we don't block. Okay. Well, I'll see what he does here. Yeah, we're not blocking. That's for sure. Opponent notably playing much faster <laughs> than we are. Didn't even notice that right away, looking at the clock. It's just so often the other way around. <laughs> but I guess I'm doing, doing a lot of talking. I'm kind of hyper. What is this? Sacrifice an enchantment and put a plus one, one plus one can counter on. Okay, we can sacrifice our obscuring ether. That's fine. And that puts that, I guess, out of range. That was the plan. Um, all right. Well, I want to flip that. kill that and maybe run the risk of getting owned there but I think I'm okay with this so I'm just gonna pass back so I'm hoping he'll attack and I can block and then flip up and get the two for one. Okay, step one. Step two. Oh, you know what? It's even better because I always forget about the Trail of Mystery pumping. So I get to just hound his guy, unless he's got another spell that does something. Nope. Phalanx leader, which we will immediately destroy. All right. Well, that worked out pretty well for us. The fetch lands make great ammo, also. <laughs> you know, later in the game here. Let's grab a forest. Okay, get in there for three. And from this spot, I, I kind of like our chances. Matagorger Hydra. Wow. Either I'm lagging really bad or he played that like really, really fast. I'm going to wait till I untap, maybe, before I burn this. This way, if I need to throw a second thing at it, I can. Nope, we did not need to. I'm going to flip this 
Fire Shaman. Wild Call, yeah. Sure, I'll play a Wild Call. Sure, I'll fetch a land. We get a planes here. Um, and I think I'll, I'll hold on to it as ammo. I don't think we need to play it here. Attack. And opponent is DOB. And concedes. Nice! We got destroyed game two. We won a really long fought game one. And game three, we just, you know, we did what our deck was supposed to do. And it, were, it looked pretty, pretty beautiful there, gotta say.